in this video i'll show you how we can use getter and setter methods in typescript so first let me create one class suppose the name of the class is student and here i'm gonna initialize one variable and this is the default variable this is another variable and we will write two methods here one is called getter and another one is called setter so the first one is a get method so this is we have to use this keyword get then the method name and it will return something so for this example we can return this age value then i'm gonna uh, create another method it's the setter method so set keyword is used for this age and it will take one parameter and it's of type number then i'm gonna simply assign this value to age now if i create one object let s equal to new student it will create one object as and just we can assign the value for age using like this see i'm not using this okay i'm not directly assigning this value i'm calling this method to assign to this value and i can use the dot property and it will assign that value to this age now let me print the value console the log similarly i can get the edge like this so here you can see that we are getting both of the, uh, we can access both of these but if i make this private then only this will be age will be visible so if i print the age then it will print 12 these methods are useful if you want to do part from any other logical operations before setting the values other than that these are not very useful because you can directly access any of these public uh, variables so if uh, if i remove this as well for this example it will work because we are not doing any other logical operations on this edge property let's say i'm creating one more fill private age string and this is a string this is a string variable and when we are setting the age then i am also setting the age string uh, variable and for that this years okay so once we are setting the value uh, which are uh, the age property then first we are assigning this value to age and then we are sending this to the age string then we have to write one more get method that one is for getting to get the age string age string return this dot age string now if i print Head string I'll get 12 years so we are assigning only for the age but internally we are assigning this value to the string and also to this number similarly we can also check for the age and if the age is invalid we can simply throw an error suppose if it is less than one then we'll throw one error throw new error and let's say this invalid it okay now if i try to set any invalid values like zero then it will throw me one error so this thing we you don't have to write it here like if uh, this edge is less than zero then set this otherwise don't throw an error you can write it inside this class so for these types of things get and set methods are useful so that's all for get and set methods if you have any questions or if you have any queries please drop one comment below thanks